Hey guys, it's the Mind Detective, and today we're talking about 11 subtle flirting tips for the shy and introverted. If you're someone who struggles to flirt, or if you just want to learn how to do it more subtly, then this video is for you. Tip hash one, smile and make eye contact. This is a classic flirting technique for a reason. It shows the other person that you're interested in them and that you're approachable. When you smile, it releases endorphins, which make you feel good. It also makes you look more friendly and approachable. Eye contact is another great way to show someone that you're interested in them. It's also a way to show that you're confident and that you're not afraid to make a connection. Tip hash two, compliment them. Be sincere and specific when giving compliments. People can tell when you're being fake, so make sure your compliments are genuine. Instead of saying something general like, you look nice today, try complimenting them on something specific, like their new haircut or their outfit. You can also compliment them on their personality or their accomplishments. Tip hash three, find common interests. This will give you something to talk about and help you build a connection. You can ask them about their hobbies, their favorite books or movies, or their travel experiences. If you can find something that you're both interested in, it will make the conversation flow more easily and you'll both be more likely to have a good time. Tip hash four, be a good listener. Ask questions and really listen to the other person's answers. This shows that you're interested in them and that you value what they have to say. When you're listening to someone, make eye contact, nod your head and smile. You can also ask follow-up questions to show that you're engaged in the conversation. Tip hash five, touch them lightly. This could be a gentle touch on the arm or shoulder or a high five. Physical touch is a great way to show someone that you're interested in them, but be careful not to be too aggressive. Start with small, subtle touches and see how the other person responds. If they seem uncomfortable, back off. Tip hash six, tease them playfully. This shows that you're comfortable with them and that you enjoy their company. Just be sure to keep it lighthearted and avoid anything that could be hurtful. You can tease them about their taste in music, their favorite sports team, or even their fashion sense. Just make sure you're both having fun. Tip hash seven, give them your full attention. Don't check your phone or look around the room when you're talking to them. This shows that you're interested in what they have to say and that you value their time. If you're talking to someone and you need to check your phone, excuse yourself and come back to the conversation when you're finished. Tip hash eight, make yourself available. If you're interested in someone, make an effort to spend time with them. This could be inviting them to coffee, going to a movie together, or just hanging out at a mutual friend's party. If you're always too busy to see them, they'll eventually get the message that you're not interested. Tip hash nine, be yourself. Don't try to be someone you're not, because people can tell when you're being fake. Just be your genuine self and let the other person get to know the real you. If you're trying to be someone you're not, the other person will be able to tell and they'll be less likely to be interested in you. Tip hash 10. Don't be afraid to ask them out. If you're interested in someone, don't be afraid to ask them out on a date. The worst that can happen is they say no. But if they say yes, you could be starting a new relationship. When you ask someone out, be confident and direct. Don't beat around the bush. Just say something like, I'm having a great time talking to you. Would you like to go out for coffee sometime? Tip hash 11, be patient. It takes time to get to know someone and to build a relationship. Don't get discouraged if you don't see results immediately. Just keep being yourself and putting yourself out there. Eventually, you'll find someone who's interested in you too. So those are my 11 subtle flirting tips for the shy and introverted. Remember, the key to flirting is to be genuine and to have fun. If you're doing both of those things, then you're sure to be successful. Here are a few additional tips to keep in mind. Don't take yourself too seriously. Flirting should be lighthearted and fun. Don't be afraid to make mistakes. Everyone makes mistakes when they're flirting. Just laugh it off and move on. Don't be afraid to be rejected. Rejection is a part of life. It doesn't mean that there's anything wrong with you. Just pick yourself up and keep trying. Flirting can be a great way to meet new people and to build relationships. So go out there and have some fun. Bonus tip. If you're feeling really nervous about flirting, try practicing on your friends or family members. This will help you to get more comfortable with the process and it will also give you some feedback on how you're doing. 